we promised, we have the winner and the runner-up in the How I Spent My Winter Vacation essay competition that was held all over Skokie in the Tri-City areas. This first young man is a third grader at the Minerva Elementary Education, Educational Center, excuse me, and uh, he is a eight-year-old young man. I think you're going to enjoy him. How about a nice uh, Wake Up Skokie welcome for uh, second place winner, How I Spent My Winter Vacation essay contest, young Bobby Nearman. Hey, hey, thank you. <coughs> I, <coughs> I always spent my winter vacation by Bobby Nearman. I really like playing hockey. You would be hard put to find anyone who likes playing hockey more than me, Bobby Nearman. I remember one game in particular against a team called the Demons. They're notorious for playing dirty. Well, I remember that game because it was late in the third period with only one minute left to go, and I had possession of the puck. I was skating down the ice full fury. I stick handled by one demon player. Then I stick handled by another demon player. Then I noticed one demon player approaching me from that side. He had his hockey stick straight up in the air, and he looked like he was up to no good. My suspicions were correct, because before I knew it, he came smashing down with his hockey stick across my chest, and he popped out one of my clavicles. You can't see the scar, but it's in there. I looked down in horror, and I looked down, and I saw my clavicle bone dangle before my eyes. I thought, this is a good reason to skate faster, which I did. I kept still with possession of the puck. Then I noticed another demon hockey player. He looked like he was up to no good too, because he was approaching me with his hockey skate straight up in the air, and it's very sharp. Well, before I knew it, it had slashed my thigh open, and it ripped out my femoral artery. I started spraying blood all over the place, an oscillating sea of red, back and forth, back and forth. I was losing consciousness, so I said, you know, I better release a slap shot before I don't have any blood left. Well, I did, but it was such a hard slap shot that I, lo I lost my balance, and I fell down on the ice, and I scratched my retina up real bad. Two weeks later, I came to the hospital not knowing what had happened to me. My parents were there. My friends were there. My other friends from the old neighborhood were there. They said, good game, Bobby. That last shot of yours went in. You won the game for us. You're our hero. And I said, oh, okay, thanks a lot. See, I couldn't really talk to them long because when I fell down and scratched my retina on the ice, I could only see the color blue. So the doctor scheduled me for a CAT scan. But on the way down to go get my CAT scan, I got mistaken for another patient, and I ended up getting a pap smear by mistake. I learned a valuable lesson whenever you play hockey. Be careful. Thanks. 